Good night, my name is Juan Zapata and my code is 0025 and today I'm going to talk you about a team named Reckless Corporate Farming Practice. What this consists. Okay, this consists on um, knowing I I was like um investigating about two sources that give us a lot of information. In the first source those was um, sustainable, sustainability of land use traded. Um, they are telling me how to make a sustainable farming, a sustainable agriculture. That is the tendency. Is the tendency that is um, in the world right now. That is making organic agriculture. Why people is making this? Because um, the soil is degrading because about all the chemicals that the farmers are using. So, to we don't have... To we don't have these problems with... Um, 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 this problem with the, with the synthetic um, chemicals that we use to um to fight with um sickness of the plants so we can start using the organic agriculture this way um this way everybody can have a sustainable agriculture and um, the second the second source was named was named intensive farming and market and uh, this in this in this source the author um, explained from the point of view of a lot of farmers that were using normal agriculture and they are having problems with the cows with some sickness that the cows are having for the chemicals that they're using in the grass they the cows eat so they are using a lot of antibiotics and this is not good because it can affect the milk can affect the meat of the cow if you're selling it for food so that those farmers that were using this kind of agriculture are starting to experiment with organic agriculture because it's a better way to have um, to have to make agriculture in a sustainable way. What is happening with the natural resources? The natural resources are getting degraded because the the um, the soil is getting degraded about all the chemicals, and this is not a good good way to make agriculture because we are going to have a uh, bad bad soils in the future so the way that we can uh, do to to prevent this is making practice the practice another way of farm farming that is like organic farm or um something that is helpful to the to the environment thank you